for all the bitch ass niggas. This last round, if you a bitch ass nigga, this is for you. Baby mama bullshit is what you go through. But you ain't supposed to start doing shit that the hoes do, nigga. Hey yo, play my shit. Get the fuck up, let's get to it. It's me. It's official. It's Young Buck. I'm on this West Coast. Salute to my manager, Big U. Salute to everybody out here that's, that's playing a part in getting Young Buck where he need to be. Appreciate it. So what's coming up with you? Any new albums, new tour? Definitely. I'm working on a, you know, everything I release, I kind of put it in album, album material. So my next project will be a mixtape that's titled Bomb Money. Shout out to Maybach Music. And uh, it's produced, the whole entire mi mixtape is produced by A1, which is one of Maybach Music's producers. A lot of features, a lot of different artists. Uh, the drop date was September 25th, and I pushed it back because we got a lot of artists that want to be a part of the project. And, you know, I felt like, you know, at this point, we're just going to take our time with it and make sure we deliver, you know, this classic material. <laughs> Dub C, how are you doing today? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm out here with Cat A. Making it happen, sold our crowd. Came off stage doing the bed. You had the hottest performance tonight. It was oh, definitely going down, definitely with the sea walk okay. and everything. Okay. Representing in the all blue, yeah. that's for sure. It's all good. They only gave me a couple of minutes. I couldn't really open up like I wanted to. Well, you still look good out there. Thank you. So please tell us what's new with you. It's hard to do an it's hard to do an interview. She's so yeah. cool, doesn't she? Thank She's you. A cat. Mm -hmm. What's new with you? Um, new album. Revenge of the Bear Cooter the South, courtesy of Lynch My Records on Big Swain, uh, slash E1, also two on tour right now. Um, just came home to do this right here, but I'm out, you know, just making it happen on the road with Ice Cube. Um, Cube working on a new album, I'm working on a new album, Young Melee album, CT Experience. There's just so much going on. So you hitting the road with Cube, so that's got to be going down. That's the West Side all day. Yeah, all day. Feel good, you know what I mean? K Day, Fresh Fest, what, 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 you know what? What else? So, Return of the Chicken Hawk, I'm hearing all about it. Tell me something about that. Hustler music, money in the powder, that's it. Going hard, ain't nothing but grinding on that one. That's it, that's it, that's all. So, is there any high features on that track right now? Everybody that's a D boy will be on there, you know what I mean? Ross Burr, man, you know, Jeezy Weezy, like, you know, and the list goes on. That sounds like a platinum album coming out. Hopefully. Any any videos? So we look out on YouTube, anything? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna start shooting videos in a couple of months because you know it'll be our first quarter. But you know, I might leak something early. But like I said, we turn the chicken off. All deep boy. Yeah.
Fresh Fest 2011. How are you feeling tonight? Doing okay. I'm doing okay. How you doing? I'm doing excellent. Now I'm here with you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so uh, Retreat Revenge. Let's talk about that. You know, graveyard shifts. Oh. You know, right now, out in stores right now, uh, revenue retrieving, graveyard shift, revenue retrieving, overtime shift. I also did revenue retrieving, day shift and night shift, all in one year. Bonafide albums, all charted top 10 rap charts, all charted top 50, uh, top 200 charts. Just so y'all know, just because a lot of people don't know these things. You see what I'm saying? I'm talking about two, top 200 overall, you understand me? So anyway, um, but uh, Fody doing this thing, man. Ain't no liaisons. I got a distribution deal with EMI. It's heavy on the grind. EMI, you understand me? So that's where we at. Okay, so over the stove. Let's talk about that. Is that a alternate career choice that would have been for you if you hadn't have been a rapper? Over the stove. Over the stove was one of them records where it's just. See, you gotta realize I'm all. I'm, I'm a. I'm a. Uh, I'm a soil narrator. When I say soil, I'm a hood narrator. I talk, I talk for the people. I talk for the people. So basically, that's just letting people know, hey man, look, if this don't work out, I'm going back to the game. So I'm just like a storyteller. But it, but at the same time, I've been successful with my career. So it, I, evidently, it ain't talking about me. 